morning guys welcome back to today's video it is Saturday morning my favorite day of the week Sam and I are headed out to go and do some shopping I love shopping in fall so much better than summer I hated shopping this summer I hate being away love my animals I hate when bad weather keeps us away from them too but anyway we're headed out to go shopping and I want to tell you really quick about the movie that we saw last night how'd you like the movie last night <laughs> I loved it. I thought it was really good. My son saw it with his wife and they said it wasn't very good. I loved it. It was so powerful to me. It, it wasn't like so super emotional. It didn't make me cry. It didn't make me feel overwhelmed by emotion. But it was so powerful. It like told the story about this woman who had, whose parent, whose mom suffered domestic abuse when she was young and her mom never left. And then her, he's gonna brush his hair. <laughs> and then see, country life makes you forget, guys. It makes you forget, like, cause you go outside in the morning before you brush your teeth, brush your hair, all that stuff. Anyways, it tells a story about a girl, a woman who suffered, her mom suffered domestic abuse when she was growing up. And then she ended up with a guy who was lovely, uh, but, had issues himself and it basically told both sides of the story like how this guy got to be the way he was and how he didn't want to be the way that he was and it's a disease it's like a problem you have to get help for it sometimes you think you can handle stuff and you can't like anyways um and in the end she decided to stand strong and to and she had a baby and it was a baby girl and she decided that it ends with that this abusive situation where you she decided it ended with her and her baby she wasn't gonna live that life and so she moved on and and it was really good it was a good book it was a good movie she asked her mom like why did you stay and she said it was too hard to leave and it could be so hard to leave like I wish we could nor normalize standing up and saying no like this is not okay and being able to leave I wish our government system supported women stronger and, and and made it easier for women to leave when they needed to leave. But anyways, it was a good movie. I loved it. I'd like to see more movies. I'd like to see more controversial movies. Movies that can unlock that stigma that people feel. I wish that men who are abusive could go to the doctor and say, listen, I have anger problems and I don't know where it comes from and I don't know how to fix it. I need help. I wish like men feel confident enough to do that. Like there's just so much stigma. But anyway, on to a lighter topic. It is 9 a.m. and we're headed out. Sophie's already up. She's so much like me. Holy moly. She's also like Sam. Like both of them are, they're so different. Like Gabby's a lot like me, but she's mostly Sam. But she has me in her. And then Sophie is mostly like me, but she has Sam in her. I feel like Sophie has all the good parts of me and all the bad parts of Sam. And Gabby has all the bad parts of me and all the good parts of Sam. Like, it's just crazy. Genetics is crazy. It's a roll of the dice. It's a roll of the dice. So, welcome to today and let's go. I'm gonna get my shopping done. I just need to get a few things to um, prepare for next week. And Sam and I get to spend time together. Right? Yeah. And lady destroyed the bench. Lady destroyed the bench? Videos. I'll show you the video now. I'll show you the video? What? What? Oh my gosh. Okay, I gotta go watch That's the video. The problem. She, she was wood, so I don't know, like, when she's bored or I don't know. Yeah, like, even if she's not in a stall, like she gets. Area and she just yeah, did you lock them in last night? No. Yeah, so she can go outside, she can roam around, she can do what she wants, but she decided to go in and destroy our bench. She just make up wall for her to chew on or something like that. I don't know if that's a good idea. Anyways. Good morning guys. Welcome to today. The horses are coming in for breakfast. Uh oh. Penny's not being nice. And can you guess what happened here? Can you guess what happened here, Penny? I know exactly what happened here. Lady. Lady is a destroyer of wood. And she knocked over this wood bench and she actually broke it. <laughs> she actually broke the bench. And 
and she chewed it all apart. It's all chewed apart. How did she? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to make something for her to chew on. But yeah, she destroyed the bench. Need metal, need metal bench now. Hey Storm, you ready for breakfast? It's actually cold, like fall cold. I love it, I'm loving it. So did you figure it out? No. Not yet? I, need, I have chains, but I don't know where they are. So we went to the second hand store yeah, put them on these and we found out. this. Show them what it is. It's this. Somebody made it and it's for like hanging your dogs up so that you can do their nails. It only costs two bucks. Yeah, they sit in there. They sit in there. Put Ellie in there. We'll see if it works. I don't think, I think we should put your dog in there. Kirby. Like, come here, Kirby. <laughs> no, we're not going to try and torture you. Pig. Come on. Come on, guinea pig. <laughs> Oh, come here. All right, we're gonna we're gonna put her in and then we're gonna show you guys. <laughs> All right. There we have her. She's so calm in it. You guys know what I'm planning, don't you? <laughs> so I wanna cut my pig's nails and I wanna use this. So I have another one that's a bit bigger and made out of different material, but this one has legs. The other one doesn't have legs. It's just like a, I'll show you. I'll show you guys. So Sam's trying to figure out Sam's, Sam is trying to figure out how we can chain it. It has these little grommets. Is that what they're called? Yeah. To hold it up. And I don't feel like that's super strong. No, it doesn't look strong, does it? But you, we can't tie a rope to it because we're not going to be able to knot it. So we need a chain with hooks. And we're going to do it. We're going to cut my piggy's nails today. Today's the day. Super excited to do it. Like super excited. But I don't want my pig to go splat. Pen, what's wrong? What's wrong, princess? What's wrong? What's wrong, my little princess? What's wrong? What's wrong? Yeah, I love you. I told the girls we need everybody's hands on deck for this project. Actually, I wonder if that would hold it. It's too big, too thick. Anyway, I don't see my piggy. Guess is that my pig is down at the goat barn because she's probably warmer there. Hi, baby. Say hi. Say hi. So cold. Oh, that's perfect. I know. That dog is about to trip us. She's like in and out of your feet all the time. So the bench died. And he knows it's Lady because she chewed the wood down there and she's got the longest neck, the only neck that would. But look it, it's like the whole thing is broken. Do you want to take it out? The carry it? Garbage fire pit. Yeah. Now. Let's take it out. Like look, all those pieces. Every day another disaster. Every day. <laughs> but that's okay. If you didn't have a, a problem to fix every day, you'd be bored. Every single day we post a video. Every single day we have something to do. Every single day this farm gets Sam and I outside, busy, walking, moving, doing stuff. And I swear it's so important to be physically active and it's so important for your mind to be busy. And it's amazing, like this farm has been such a blessing. I know I say it every single day, but I'm hoping that somebody out there who feels stuck and needs like a little push to see how amazing their life truly is, a little push to see the beauty in their life, might be able to see our journey and see truly how amazing their life is just the way that it is. Because as people, we're always looking for the next best thing. Never satisfied. But I want you guys to be satisfied and find beauty in everything you do. Are you ready? For the experience of your life, <laughs> it's gonna be. Ew. You stink. He only stinks when he does whatever he does. He doesn't stink all the time. Like a boy goat will stink all the time. He doesn't, but he stinks right now. And honestly, his smell actually like gags me. 
The boy goat smell doesn't bother me. Oh, there you are. You are getting ready for some fun, Posy Pig. You might as well come in. Come on in. Oh, hello, little puppies. I know. I brought her in so she didn't run off. So where will we string it? That's the problem. It has to be... Well, look. You can string it through this. Like, this is a huge beam. This could hold a pig. That's easy. We're going to string it through there. Where there's a will, though, there's a way. Not that way. Hold me. I was going to hold Put it in. Put you guys are all judging my choices. You don't think that can hold you? It holds Kirby. Okay, Kirby's smaller and skinnier than the pig. So, uh, this is important to me, and I want to do it like the easiest way possible. Okay. And nobody believes in me. I feel like the only person that I can work with so well is my sister because she's like me. She just will like keep working, keep working until she figures out the easiest way to do it. I'm going to show you guys the other thing that I have. Feel this? It's so... It's so strong. Okay, so we got already, we're getting there. But I lost the other thing that I have. So this is the other thing that I have. really strong. So That's just, not gonna hold her either. That's that gonna might. tip her. But that would, yeah. If she throws a fit, that's gonna uh, tip. I kind of have an idea now. Ha <laughs> ha, see? <laughs> She's just foraging. All right, let's try this. Come here, piggy. Don't run away. Come here. You guys need to be locked in the stall. They're just causing problems. In fact, we should lock the pig in a stall too. Where'd she go now? Okay. Catch that pig. Come here, baby. Wait until you see what we're going to do to you. You're going to love it. <laughs> Sophie, I need your help. All right, so use these. These for sure won't break. I pulled on it and it broke. <laughs> it's good that happened. That's definitely going to fall on the back. I mean, Baylor twine. Literally took I got Baylor twine. Break it. That looks bad and it's going to break. Yeah, I say use that stuff. Nothing Just shove those through. We only need two. Here, let me see. All right, this you guys are worse than dogs. the dogs. Okay, so this is the problem. I locked all the dogs in here, but Ellie can jump it. Oh my gosh, this is this is this is my life. Ellie. Everything is chaotic. Ellie, I put you in a stall for a reason. I think she broke something. Oh no. Ah. She's foraging for sure. Oh my gosh. Posy. Ellie. Ugh. Everybody Ellie. goes in a stall. Listen, there are treats for everyone if you behave and let us do this to you, okay? So now how did this dog get out? She stuck through the door. She ran through. All right, yeah. let's see here. The only one that's in there is... It's the one that's actually big. Should we try Molly first? We should try Cat. Cats no, always land on their feet. You are not making my dog. Okay, my cat, if you... I'm worried my... I'm worried my pig will go splat. She will. Bacon? Bacon, anyone? Don't worry, it'll be slow. Uh. Time for the material. <laughs> They're just joking, you guys. They are not cold-hearted. They're just joking. We're a joking family. All right, it's coming. That wow. A very high drop. All right, you guys. That's for the front. Okay, this one I have faith that... Oh, wait. Okay, get Kirby. Try it. Get Kirby. We're going to try it. Give me a Kirby. Oh, my God. No. Give me a Kirby. Oh, I literally... She's getting fat. Jeez. Okay. She's getting big. She's getting long-legged. Put her in there her legs. I just want like 10 minutes of uninterrupted huh? moving Head one way, okay? and it makes them it makes them calm I just want 10 minutes to cut Head, nails not that way Head. well I'm putting her feet in first yeah this way okay that's what I was that thinking. way oh my god that's that what I was doing the in the beginning wait why am I holding this because you're Kirby a independent woman you're the newest one on the block so okay. you're the tre you're I can't the tester. Get leg in. this legs in I can't she doesn't fit this way. Yes, she does. We already tried it. We already did it. <laughs> oh, she doesn't. <laughs> Whoa. All right, so this is probably not something that's going to happen today. Leave it up there. 
We need like a pulley system, but she squeals a lot. Yeah, but the squealing isn't a big deal. Jump, if we hired somebody to come and do it, they would just lay her down on the ground on her back and hold her down. And I want to try and do it in a gentler way. If you flip her over, at least there's no going flat. Sophie says just flip her over at this point, it's the same. But honestly, I just need better workers. I, I just need okay. better workers. I better farm hands. <laughs> Listen. Let's be friends. We're still early in the game. We have lots of time to figure it out. I don't want to lay them down. I feel like that's kind of traumatic. There's something you can buy. We should look it up. There's something I can buy? Maybe we should look see if there's something we can buy. I think we just bought all the things that we could buy. Anyway, I'm gonna do a little bit more research and try and figure out like a more, another more gentle way. Pigs don't like it if their feet are on the ground. It stresses them out. They also don't like it if they're flat on their back. Back to the drawing board, you guys. Don't you know that you're beautiful?